Hi, I'm Dan. The last time you saw me, I was uh, showing you how to coat bullets with high-tech bullet coating. Here they are right here. These are done with that. And what I've done is I have come up with a way to size this machine, use this uh, star sizer automatically so that you don't have to stand there and pull down that handle over and over again. You saw that in the introduction. Right now, I want to show you some of the parts and how they work. All right, this is designed primarily for use with coated bullets. Although I've not tried it with uh, using wax lube, you could do that. You'll see here I have the heated base because I used to do it with the, with the wax, but I have uh, just left it there because it was convenient for me. You could take this off and mount it directly to the table. All right, so what you have is an actuator, which is a pneumatic actuator. So it pushes it forward and it pulls it back. It's a double acting, so that means that it uses pressure to go out and pressure to come back because it loads a new bullet each time. This is the magma uh, bullet, automatic bullet feeder, and this is the tube that comes with it that would hold an extension tube that you can load more into. Unfortunately, if you use that, then, uh, well, it's, it just takes you longer to do it than doing it by hand, and I'll show you that later. All right, so you need a, an actuator, and you need something to hold it here. I've got something to hold it here. You need a, uh, a solenoid, and that's what gives the impulse of, of sending the air. It directs the air from one side to the other, in and out. You need an on and off switch because of something that you may need to, to change it in a hurry or stop it in a hurry. And then you need a timer, and this is the timer that I have here. Very simple operation. And, of course, you need an air compressor. Uh, I'm using about 75 pounds of pressure, and that's not a lot to run, and it, it'll run a long time without even having to recycle it. So um, this, this will do probably about 12 to 1,500 an hour. Uh, I can't imagine what my arm would feel like <laughs> if I was doing 1,500 of those in an hour trying to do it by hand. So I just want to let you know that you can do this. This is simple and it's easy. And I'm going to give you, at the end of this video, I'm going to give you a parts list. I ordered all the parts from, from Granger. I'm not advertising for them, but I have all the parts numbers on there if you want to do that. It, it doesn't have things like wire or switch like this, but all the main parts you'll see are there. There are a few parts that I will show you in more detail in the next video. Uh, so. Just figure out you can do this if you want to. Well, tune into the second video. Thanks for watching.